welcome back to my channel so today's video i'm going to be doing this look right here it was festival inspired look i have been seeing this kind of looks all over instagram so i thought i should try it out i like how it turned out but the depth on my crease doesn't show in the video so i don't know what is it but i really like how this blue turned out so if you guys wanna learn how to get this look then keep on watching i'm going to start by using this morphe 35b palette and going to take the lightest blue shade as my transition shade I'm going to put this all over our crease now i'm taking this dark blue color and going to put this on my crease in between my transition shades so we will have a depth on our crease i'm using mac 217 brush now i'm taking this mac soft toker paint pot and going to curve out my crease so we will have a really flat canvas when we use the next eyeshadow now i'm taking this blue color it has a little bit shine on it so it's perfect for lead color so i'm putting this all over my lid now I'm taking this Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner in Blackest Black and going to put this from inner corner to outer corner then I'm going to connect my winged eyeliner later so it has perfect like curve to it. Now I'm taking this NYX eyeliner in Crystal Agua and going to put this over my gel eyeliner. Now I'm taking this L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and going to curl my eyelashes. Now I'm taking this Huda Beauty eyelashes in Scarlet and going to apply this on top of my eyelashes. Now I'm taking this transition color again and going to put this on my lower lash line. Now I'm taking this Sephora brand eye pencil in all black everything and going to apply this on my waterline. Now I'm taking this Maybelline Colossal Big Shot mascara and going to curl my lashes. Now I'm taking this gems from Walmart and going to put this on close to my lower lash line. It's right in between and going to put three of them next to it. As you can see I'm trying to make it look really organized so I use duo eyelash glue in clear and I use the darkest gem on the middle. Now I'm taking this crystal liner again and going to put this on be in between of the tones so it looks really put together. And also putting this on my inner corner. For the last and final step I'm using this Anastasia lip gloss in Kristen and going to apply this all over my lip and this is the finished look thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my channel and follow me on my social media and i will see you guys in my next tutorial bye